Now happening today, Boulder Fire Rescue preparing for a worst case scenario. Well, they've been conducting active shooter trainings all week. Today, Fox 31's Courtney Fromm is getting a sneak peek, and we know how important and, quite frankly, imperative these trainings are, Courtney. Yeah, good morning, Kirk, Kirk and Ash. That's exactly right, and unfortunately, it's planning for worst case scenario. It's something we never want to say is going to happen, but they have to train for it. And they, we were just talking to them a few minutes ago and they say getting these reps in is so important when it comes to being a first responder in this type of situation. I'm going to pan over right now. You can kind of see they're actually um, doing some of this live training right in the parking lot. You can see they've got the ballistic gear, all this stuff happening at Calvary Bible Church. So we talked to them for a while. They said the training actually starts outside here. You can see that's police right here, Boulder Police. Um, on the other side, Danny, do you want to pan over this way real quick. You can also see that the fire department is also here and EMS. So this training will eventually move inside to the church and that's where they'll work with um, dummies and then also live actors who are pretending to play the role of being injured. And again, we remind you the pictures and videos you are looking at. You can see them running over here, Danny, but pictures and videos that you are watching. This is all just a training. Keep that in mind. But like they said, it's an important training to have happen. We're watching it go right now and you can hear why it's so important to do so. It's going to be a little bit chaotic and so we do these trainings because it helps to bring a little bit of order to that chaos and it helps us to achieve our three tactical goals which is to stop the killing, stop the dying and then rapid evacuation of our victims. Uh, we take it very seriously. We know that this is that these events are catastrophic for the community and that's why we are passionate about making sure that we are prepared, we're trained, all the responders are prepared and trained and, and we do this on a consistent basis. Again, we want to remind everybody this is just a training happening this morning, but you can see they're running in. A few other police officers just ran into that church in this training scenario. You can see the signs all around here, but they're going to enter the church. And then I've already been in there, but if you go in and inside will be the actors um, and then obviously the dummies as well laying on the ground as victims. Um, really important training happening. It's going to be it's been happening all week from nine in the morning or eight in the morning until like 11 p.m. at night. All the agencies within Boulder Police and, of course, Boulder Fire out here getting this important training. Um, but if you're in the area, just keep in mind, they're just working out um, on this right now. So anyways, live in Boulder, Courtney from Fox 31. Courtney, thank you.